unbelievable. Milk, eggs, veggies. Does this family have any decent junk food? Not even any ice cream. What's this? Probably frozen possum for stew. Can it be? A popsicle? It is. Oh, it's my fellow aspiring waitress. Did you get the job at the yacht club? I don't know. I haven't heard yet. Me neither. But then I, I really don't expect to. I can't believe those are still here. I bought those for Pete. Oh. Um. Well, he, he's not here anymore, right? And anyway, this has got major freezer burn. So, I guess you're not here to talk about what's in the fridge, are you? No. Is Caleb here? Oh, you're in luck. He just took a break from the cabbage worms. Caleb! Is somebody here to see you? So, I hear you're staying with that guy, Andy Dixon. Yeah. Don't get the wrong idea. He's, he's my best friend. He, he came by here a couple of days ago. I wish we'd had more time to talk. I don't think we got off on the right foot. You and Andy? What? I... I think I'll see what needs doing in the barn. I guess I should have called first. I just really wanted to see you. Today's our anniversary, in case you forgot. No, I didn't forget. I just, uh, I wasn't sure, you know, if... Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I felt the same way. Well, here you go. Julie, I don't want you to give me things. I mean, we're barely speaking to one another. You think it's going to make everything okay if you give me a present? No, that's not why I bought it. I saw it in the window and I thought of you and of us. Just, I wanted to get it for you. Why don't you open it? How'd you pay for it? Money left over from Hans? What a nasty thing to say to me. I bought you this beautiful book of Paris because I thought maybe you and I could look at it together and remember what it was like when we were happy. I paid for it with money that I made bartending. What? Don't you believe me? What is it with you, Caleb? How dare you pass judgment on me? You know, I've been punished. I lost my son for well, this. I'm not punishing you, Julie, but I can't just conveniently forget everything that's happened, that's all. Asking you to forget, I, I'm just sick and tired of being the bad guy right, here. So what do you want from me? What do you want me to do, huh? You want me to, to pretend that everything's okay? You, you didn't lie to me? You didn't put my whole family in danger? All right, that's it! That's it! You know, I'm just so sick of this holier-than-thou attitude that you have, Caleb Snyder. I don't care what you do with that damn book. You can throw it in the incinerator for all I care. I'm out of here. I didn't realize anybody else would be out here. No, I was just taking a little break, that's all. I guess you both have the same idea. Want a little company or would you rather be alone? No, please stay. 